Today we're going to talk about the rising problem of myopia progression in children and what we can do to prevent it. I'm here with Professor Maria Liu to learn about her solution to correct nearsightedness and prevent childhood myopia from progressing. Cooper Vision's MySight One Day Disposable Contact Lens. Stay tuned to learn more about why MySight One Day lenses are a crucial part of the myopia management toolbox and when and why to prescribe them. So how can early childhood intervention prevent both myopic progression and further complications from developing later in life, would you say, Maria? So certainly from animal studies, we know axial length elongation can be a process that's due to like abnormal visual experience in early development. Mm -hmm. And especially in human myopia, by um, early intervention and slowing down this abnormal axial growth, we're able to reduce the risk of complications dramatically. Most of these complications, if left uncontrolled, can actually cause irreversible vision loss. Let's talk a little bit about how myopia in children is currently managed. What are some of the treatment options available in younger patients, would you say? So certainly, um, to answer that question, we have to first define what's myopia management versus myopia control. If we're focusing on myopia control, which targets at not only pro providing clear vision for children, but also to slow down the progression of their myopic refractive error and axial elongation. And in that respect, uh, myopia control is practiced quite differently depending on the countries or the regions where options may not be available. So in US, we have primarily three evidence-based treatment options, the daytime dual focus contact lenses, the overnight orthokeratology lenses, and low-dose atropine. All of them, with the exception of a MySight one day, are still considered off-label use, meaning they are not FDA approved for the indication myopia control, even though they themselves are FDA approved the treatment or devices. I see. And in your opinion, which of those options provide the best outcomes for children and why? Um, in my personal opinion, I don't think there is one best option. The best option, number one, has to be something the children likes to wear, and so compliance is our number one concern. But in terms of the overall efficacy uh, reported in clinical studies, it looks like the daytime dual focal contacts and the overnight orthokeratology overall provide about 50 to 60% of uh, myopia inhibiting effect, although with a huge individual variability, meaning some kids respond to their treatment very well. After several years of doing their treatment, we're not seeing any progression at all, but some other kids still progress um, quite significantly despite the treatment. Fascinating. How would you say Cooper Vision's MySight one day disposable contact lenses differ from other daily lenses on the market? So the, um, the fundamental difference is obviously the FDA indication for myopia control. This to a lot of parents really showed that number one, FDA recognized that myopia is a controllable condition. Number two, the data from clinical trial is convincing enough for FDA to grant that um, indication. And number three, um, having that data really assures, you know, brings up a lot of confidence in parents' mind. Great points. What are some of the advantages of these lenses as well? So certainly kids wearing contact lenses, a parent's number one concern is safety. And being available in this daily disposable modality and having the FDA indication certainly increase the confidence of parents uh, allowing their kids to wear contact lenses. Can you describe what active control technology is and also how it works? So in layman words, my, uh, how I usually communicate with parents is that the lenses um, has a dual, dual function. Number one, it provides clear vision uh, for children during daytime activities. And number two, on that top layer of a clear image, the lenses is able to send a stop signal telling the eyes that, that you have grown too fast, too long, you need to slow down this growth. So this stop signal is what's unique um, from this active control technology. What is your clinical approach to prescribing MySight lenses? So my sight lenses, um, you know, in general, kids wearing soft contact lenses during the day, we have to look at several um, factors. 
The objective factors obviously include their baseline level of myopia, whether they have a lot of astigmatism, which if not uh, fully corrected, may result in slightly reduced vision. But subjectively, we need to look at the children's maturity, uh, how likely they're able to handle the lenses independently, how motivated they are in wearing contact lenses, or um, being spectacle-free so that it can, they can enjoy their vision during um, like a daily use. Are there any contraindications that you'd like to mention? Those absolute contraindications for contact lenses altogether. Kids not being able to handle the lenses, especially removing the lenses in a safely manner without their parents' supervision, that's a big concern because compared to overnight lenses where parents can participate in the application and the removal of the lenses and even cleaning the lenses, wearing soft lenses require kids to be able to handle the lenses independently when they're you know, in school without their parents' guidance. I've seen a six years old being able to handle the lenses very, very delicately and almost like a surgical precision. Yeah. But I've also seen plenty of a 12, 14 years old and not able to put in the lenses. And so not being able to handle the lenses is a number one a red flag. Number two, if they have um, a lot of astigmatism, which is currently not able to be corrected by my sight lenses, that's something we need to be um, really cautious of. And number three, if this is an environment with a lot of dust or with a lot of air pollution, we need to make sure the lenses are not accumulating all, a lot of those deposits, which may cause some conjunctivitis. Well noted. What makes the MySight One Day Disposable Contact Lenses child-friendly? For child-friendly, it's mostly their daily disposable option and the fact that parents can keep track of lens ordering process, keep track you know, through the MySight app portal, they can keep track of the changes in um, prescription. But the daily disposable option is the number one key factor that's really boosting the confidence from um, parents. And how would you say that MySight contact lenses help improve the quality of life for children and their patients or their parents or caregivers? So we know visual behavior is changing uh, when a child is becoming myopic. We know they tend to reduce their outdoor exposure and the sports activity, even though we don't know which is chicken, which is egg, meaning whether it's because they're myopic and not being able to see very well without their glasses, that's why they reduce their sports engagement, or it's the other way around. But um, wearing contact lenses will make them spectacle-free and enjoying clear vision without the restriction from the frame, which has much better cosmesis, much wider field of view, and also sharper vision. So they're more likely to resume to their visual behavior before they become nearsighted. Have you received any feedback from patients or parents that you can share? Absolutely. So, uh, kids really enjoy being able to see well without their glasses and I've got a lot of positive feedbacks of saying it's basically transforming them into a totally different person. Being able to handle the lenses give them a lot more control of themselves and also their sports performance actually improved dramatically mm -hmm. between uh, spectacle wear and contact lenses. Fantastic. Well, Maria, thank you so much for joining us here. We Thanks sure for having me here. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I want to thank Professor Maria Liu for joining us today and for sharing her knowledge, experience, and solution for preventing myopia progression in children. And it's clear that my site is the cornerstone of managing myopia in children and its prevention. We encourage you to check out their website to learn more about my site one day contact lenses and how they can benefit your young patients. Music